gentlemen, I have what every man in the world wants. And it's not the cars. It's not the money. It's not the woman. It's the newest retro ball update early, ladies and gentlemen. I have it on my phone. There are a lot of huge updates that are coming to the game that will change retro ball forever. And we're going to go over all that stuff in this video. This update allegedly, reportedly, will come out sometime midweek, next week, or the Monday after. But without further ado, let's just get into it. Thank you for updating retro ball. No problem. No problem. Among other changes, you are now able to edit player images and even select a face for yourself in the game. I can put my head in the game. Head over to the front office to choose your image. Thank you for your continued support. I appreciate that, Simon. Thank you to you as well. But let's press continue. This is my live reaction. Let's head into Team Asia right here. And let's get started. All right, let's go to front office. You need to select a face for yourself. More customizable options. Tap on the head coach card to choose an image. Okay. Oh my God. So we have an additional head coach card now wait this is sick i actually really really like this all right let's go to staff oh my god these are all of the retro ball options where's the asian guy where is the asian guy simon come on bro please tell me there's a chinese guy in here where is he ah uh, yes look at him ah uh, yeah look at him uh, look at him yeah look at the wings the zings the mouths i'm talking about oh my goodness this guy looks like a guru let's go with this guy right here i like his goggles this is the new head coach menu here and we can edit his name this would be great for my 49er series and he has a morale as well shows me my record my win percentage jesus i'm 9 and 26 that's dope and you can still hire your offensive defensive coordinator did anything change here no okay 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 let me click on the eyes see what that says this is you your morale is affected by team morale and fan approval your star rating will increase with victories okay there you go man the new head coach image is added on retro ball that's dope here is another update that comes with it we can edit player images now now it would have been nice if i had this feature beforehand while assembling this team because i literally had to refresh free agency until i found an asian wide receiver but let's check Check it out, man. Oh, okay. Wait, hold on. There's some new eyes on the right here. Let's click on each one of these, man. Catching relates to how well a player holds onto the ball while catching it after, after taking a hit. I can't read. Players receive a plus one skill buff if they are 100% happy. Oh, skill buff. Whoa. Okay, who's the happiest guy here? Ming. Let's go to Ming. There's new descriptions now as well. So actually determines... Does the skill buff show? I guess the skill buff is already in. He's exceptional, so I'm assuming he's 100% happy, but this is interesting. What about arm strength? Players receive a plus one strength buff if their morale is angry or toxic. Oh my god! Wait! All of my players are angry! Wait, so it's kind of an advantage now. They're all pissed off. Wait, let me take a look at speed. Players receive plus one speed buff if they have 100% condition. Oh, I like this. Okay, I'm assuming plus one speed buff just means another point added on this yellow bar. I don't know if it'll show you or not. Toxic players receive a plus one stamina buff. How does that make any sense? I guess you run more when you're depressed and you're sad so you know what that makes sense simon i like that this is really cool man catching apparently depends on happiness strength just depends on how toxic you are speed is on conditioning and stamina is also on toxicity which is kind of funny because you have conditioning i really like that feature that is very cool shadow retro for doing that but how do i change the players faces let me see is it edit name oh here it is look at you four pages of new faces to choose from i like this a lot where are my chinese at man where are my chingus at man where are my chingus at where are my chingus there they are look at them okay there's one of them why is there only one chinese face bro what happened to the rest of us Nah, this is ridiculous bro what happened to this face right here please tell me i missed it man okay i missed it i missed it my bad my bad my bad, my bad. we gotta add some more chinese faces man come on man we need more asians on this game i know there's not a lot of asians in the nfl but i need it i need it but here we go this is the feature that i'm talking about that i think will change the entire outlook of how retro ball will look in the future let me press continue here to show you guys what i'm talking about there you go the top right corner you can now simulate a game on retro ball i've never tried this out i have not seen how it works yes so we're gonna try simming this game right here in three two one huh is this not just me playing it okay okay wait hold on i see how this works okay so i can now click through an entire game without playing a single snap wait there's a sec okay what if i press skip time here whoa let me press it one more time i think it sims by quarter and we lose that game right there do we get the same amount of cc yep we get a cc that is crazy man because there's gonna be a lot more people with a lot more years on their saves i'm just gonna say it, all right this is gonna decrease grass touching by a million points nobody's going outside with this feature man everybody's gonna be grinding seasons now with simulate games i think it's pretty cool man because you get two options you know you can simulate through quarter by quarter or you can click on each play to see what your players are doing man. i think that's dope so here we go fourth down or field goal apparently if i pick field goal now i have the option to call a timeout oh I have the option to go for it too. Where's my timeout option though? I don't see a timeout option. Oh, apparently I can just go for it. Oh, pause? No? Oh, okay. 
Okay, well, I have the option to go for it now, which is kind of cool. So you can change your mind after kicking field goal, right? That's not the final decision now. Some of the other features are if you renew a five-star coach contract, it triggers an achievement. Coaches will not retire if they are still under contract now. They've also added a Retro Bowl MVP award. So that's really cool. Now you can stack up MVPs. I wonder if they added a new icon for that. I would show you guys, but we're in week four and I have class, so I can't really play a full season right now. Actually, let me try simulating. Here we go. I'm simming the last game right here. I simmed the whole season pretty much in less than five minutes. I do not recommend you guys simming games on extreme because guess what? My entire roster is toxic and I lost every single one of the games that I simulated. I literally went one in 16, but let's see what happens here after the season ends. Hainan wins the Retro Bowl. Shout out Hainan, you know what I'm saying? Anything else happen here? No, 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 no. New season begins. Okay, so I'm assuming what Simon means by the added Retro Bowl MVP award. I think that's just for the Retro Bowl finals. So that kind of sucks that I literally just played my Retro Bowl finals like three weeks ago. Other up Updates now, sacks do not count as rush attempts, okay? Didn't notice that problem ever, but I also don't pay attention. I can't read. And last but not least, some of the team strengths and uniforms are updated with this new update. Shout out to Coach Retro Bowl for contributing towards that. Let me know what you guys think of these new updates coming next week. What do you guys think of Simulate Game? I, I want to know. This is a big controversial update. Let me know in the comments down below and shaboing boy. Leave a like on the video if you guys enjoyed. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. If you are new, I will be giving away a million dollars to every person who clicks the subscribe button. So um, if you subscribe, you're pretty much Jeff Bezos.